we have a plan. So we're going to go straight ahead, we're going to collect that tower, and then we are going to go and do that mission for the camera in the depths. Because it looks like a starter mission, and I have googled on how to get a horse. Apparently, you just find a horse in the wild, and then try and like, jump on its back, or like lure it with an apple. So we'll do that when we spot a horse for the first time. I want to try and avoid this guy, because he looks a bit shady. Oh my god, I wanna I'm landing straight on top of this guy's head. He hasn't actually seen us, so that's good. Yeah, this this region is like super hard. We are deaf Oh look at that. All the paths in the distance. We're definitely not supposed to be here yet. So we'll just get what we can. Like those dragons are ridiculous. Look at him! Big Behemoth! Ah, we can collect them. Anything that falls from the sky we can use. That's awesome. They've got moving monsters. Splash fruit. Faster swimming. Awesome. It looks like we can go in here. However, I'm not here for that. That's going to give us another distraction. I just need to climb this mountain. Ah, who's this dude? How strange. Did you come to see the Skyview Tower? Bilson, my apologies. It looks like we have a small problem over here. What's going on? I heard that the terminal at this Skyview Tower needed repairs. Oh no. Mm. The door won't open, I have no clue why. It won't budge no matter how hard I push or pull. It's a sliding door. That's what I meant obviously. Uh. I worked up an appetite getting my brain into gear for this. I bet the nearby caves would have some tasty mushrooms. Oh. Caves at the bottom of the hill. I used to go mushroom hunting in them all the time when we were building the tower. Oh, so they don't slide either. Mm. My apologies, the door won't open for some reason. Oh, Jesus. Right, well, we're not doing this now. At least we know... At least we know there's caves beneath it. Right, come on, we're doing the main quest. This one here. Excellent, we can fast travel right next to it. Where's the person? Oh, there's the person. Hey, what's the big idea? You can't just walk behind someone who's standing over the edge of a chasm. My colleague who works with me on the Zona server team is down there. What would happen if I slipped and fell on him, huh? Don't start me again. I'm deep in my investigation work at the moment. Well, I guess it's uh, YOLO, baby. Oh my days, it's deep. Where's Robbie? Oh, here he is. Sup, partner? Oh no, that's not Robbie, that's Ponic. Are you Link? Pleasure to meet you, I'm Ponic from the Zonai Survey Team. 
Robbie told me to guide you to him once you arrived, but he rushed along in such haste that I didn't bring enough bright bloom seeds and now I've run out. I've lost sight of him. That's fine mate, oh. I've got loads. I thought he was taking a short walk over that glowing area over there. Then he just kept going. And going. Yeah, I knew he was going to say that. And going, and going. And the last I saw of him, he was heading way out there off to the west. Do you have any bright bloom seeds? I do. Ah. Great news. You're risking your life to wander without a light source. You can easily get bright bloom seeds from caves. Yeah, we know this. Ah. Attached materials. To, yeah, we know this oh. as well. Right. Muddle bud. Can confuse people, making it difficult to tell friend from foe. Right bloom seed. There we go. That's not what I wanted to do. Um. I just I, I can never get the thrown objects in this game. Just doesn't work. It's actual dog shit. Why did they make it so fucking complicated? Right, the best way to do this is just to go up. <laughs> what? <laughs> Deep firefly, got it. Being glow to anyone who consumes it. Nisoj light root. Looks like a, a shrine, doesn't it? Ah, look. Fast travel location. Awesome. And that's how we get maps of the depths. The light would dispel the darkness and brighten the surrounding area. Hey you, it's really dark down here. All right, get this please. What the hell is this? Oh, mad skills. I just caught three of them. Oh, nice bomb flowers.
Ah, oh, it's badly damaged this sword. Beautiful. Oh, hello, dead guys. No, hit the fucking seed, man. Let's try these bad boys out. Oh, this is mega damage. Damn! 20 damage on the arm. It keeps moving even after it's severed from the body. It's kind of gross to snap it to your back, but it'll do in a pinch. It's old and fragile, so it's quick to break. I'm making a mega weapon. We can use this on bosses, can't we? Right, we're there. I'll keep that because we need two. I only need two arms if I'm going to use like if I have a boss killer weapon. I'll use this as my main weapon for now. Oh, look, there's more over there. I like how we're getting loads of bombs from this area. Let's explore this. These guys seem pretty intense. Puff shroom. All of them drop arms. We're getting loads of zonite from these guys. It's well worth killing them. Where's the bombs? Shut it, you slag. Oh, don't do that. Oh, I killed myself. That's not wise. Okay, let, let's not do that again. We lost three hearts. Perfect. Oh, look, it broke. No! Bro. Shit. 
shit. This thing's gonna kill us. Yeah, he killed us. Fuck him. He's a beast, him. I think we should kill this guy from a range. He's a... I couldn't really get the, the slow motion to work on that guy, even though I was dodging his kicks. Still need to find a great favorite to enhance armor. There's so much we haven't found yet. Oh, they, yeah, that's, that is how you win this game. Bro, bombs are the best. Traveler's sword. Vocal bow. Moblin horn. Oh, large zone. It's the first time we found that. I've just realized fire destroys things. Well, the good news is we're getting we're using a lot of things. That means we can pick up, pick up new weapons. I'll take the rock hammer, I'll take the travel oh no. Rock hammer's good. Traveler's sword's quite good as well, isn't it? Traveler's sword's five. That's eleven. That's not. Two. I don't want to attach it to that. Five nine. Maybe not. I think we're good for now. Right, which way do I want to be going though? We definitely- these bomb flowers are like the best weapons in the game. We need to like preserve them. Are they always at the base of trees? Maybe only at the base of big trees? have to kill these guys. Headshot! 
Get wrecked. Slapped him across the chops with a hole. John Cena. Oh. John C oh, John Cena, that guy in Oblivion. Rock Hammer, that's better than what I've got. What is this? Oh, is that is that where we came from? No, it's not. Oh, look, there's fucking dragons. Jesus, I'm getting loads of materials here. Right. We need to get to that to create more light. This thing here. Whoa, what's happening? Get wrecked! <laughs> Fucking anti aircraft gun, Vincent. Aracuda eyeball. Attach it to an arrow to grant a home and quality. It just looks like this, just like the bat eyeballs. We can make this, let's go. I think that's him, is that him stood there? We need to go down that way, but here's a little dude. It's gotta be the guy. Rummy! What? Look at how bright that thing got. That light down in the dark is downright refreshing. Hmm. In fact, it's so luminous it's almost like... Like we're on the surface. Just standing near, it makes me feel so much better. How strange. Hey, it's you. You're finally here. I need to show you what I found. The statue. It's standing tall on two legs, one arm raised high. It looks an awful lot like the figure Josh, Josh has showed us on that piece of slate, don't you think? Alright, get that camera of yours ready, it's time to put it to work. That's right, I forgot you hadn't used the camera when we last, last spoke. Very curious indeed. Hmm. Give me that pad for a second. Guy's gonna install Gcam. Here's the problem, your camera is locked and so is your Hyrule Compendium. Hang on. If I remember correctly, you press this while you pull this. Capture images. Okay. Taking pictures of creatures, you've got no chance of me doing that. Come on, come on, just, just let me take the fucking picture. Jesus Christ, the characters in this game chat mad shit. Oh, you've got to use it. It's a special ability. What the hell? Beautiful. 
You've captured an image of the statue with your camera. Hurry up and show me. Stupendous! You've just started helping us research what's down here, but soon enough we're going to have to have even more to investigate. Time to head back to the surface. See you at Lookout Landing. Oh, well, that was easy enough. Although I kind of still want to explore this area a bit. That's on the surface, isn't it? Yeah, it is. That's on the surface. I'm going to keep going in this direction. Bro, this is ridiculously big. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh wait, there we were with. Choo choo! <laughs> so there's one of them flowers. Oh, what is that? Zoom how? Is this a beast or is this what is this? Level 7 Traveler Sword. That's not bad. Yeah, I don't really want to be here to be honest. Right. too hard not to like l walk further into the depths a curiosity is going to get me killed yeah this is a beast at least it's just saved there so that's good Horseman. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. Oh, 
Oh shit. You play them games, do you? Died, killed himself. Can we get an undead horse? Do you think we're allowed to capture this undead horse? Actually, no, I don't think you can. Because you need to take a horse to like a shop, otherwise, it doesn't become yours. Yeah, okay, there's no point in doing that. But we've been to this light source. I'm gonna go to that. This looks like an easy run. Oh, this refreshes you, but it doesn't heal you. We'll do this and then we'll leave. What the hell are these? A little frocks. Headshot. Oh, the son of a bitch. Funky ass creatures down here. Bomb arms. Ah, oh, load the bombs. Just what the doctor ordered. Shit. We have to get across this river. I've got stuff I can make to do that, I think. Oh, it's not that bad. <laughs> Got him. Nice, that's a massive area opened up. Another statue.
Uh, are these... I don't know if they're light things. And this looks like an enemy, doesn't it? Oh, a glowing spirit orb. Nice. I think I'm just going deeper and deeper into pain. I'm stopping there. I'll be, I'll be. Look at the big boy. It would be rude not to fight this guy. He's a whopper. Okay, that went, that went, to be honest, that went about as well as I thought it would. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna shoot him in the eye straight off with a bomb. See what that does. If I can, da if it bleeds, I can kill it. Basically, let's see if I can do any damage to it. Go on, do your thing and spin round. <laughs> Fuck. Kill myself. I, I've, I've got enough. I've got enough bombs to kill this. But is it worth it? That's the question. No, I don't want the fucking light seed on it. Yeah, somebody needs to be fired for whoever designed the menu for this game. It's so bad. I'm not fast enough. I'm not fast. I'm not fast enough to... Yeah! The most unfun thing about this game is the control system. It's just... It's not smooth or fast enough to make you like... Do you know what I don't know how to do either? I don't... If you, if you break your bow... I don't know how to get into the menu. Look. Right. You've got, if you've got the bow out... When you press weapons... You get a you get the bow weapon menu, right? 
if you, if for example, let me let me just show you this. Right, just break, break the ball. The ball breaks, right? I don't know. You press this button, you you go into the sword menu. Oh, if you've got your hand out like that, it then puts you in the ball menu. Right, okay. Yeah, we're not going to do this. This is not good. Terrible. Dog shit, even. I think my biggest problem with the game is that it wants to it wants to be an open world game like Ubisoft games, Far Cry games, Skyrim. I think it just does a poor job of doing it. Like, I would have preferred Zelda just to be like a normal Zelda game where you make progress, fight bosses, have fun. This is, there's a lot of fucking walk and this is like Zelda Tears of the Walking Simulator. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. It's boring, it's shit. I don't want to do it. Uh, get rid of this map marker. Was that where I was headed? Yeah, I'm not going to. Get rid of this map marker. That is on the surface, isn't it? No. I don't want any pins down here. Yeah, that's done. Right, we're getting the fuck out of here. Let's go. Dog shit, it's boring as shit. I hate it. So where's the quest? Here it is. Yeah, I think the areas are too big. There's not enough concentration of fun. There's too much... It's like, oh lads, we've got a big map for just having the, just for the sake of having a big map. It's foolish design. And the uh, lad, these menus. My god. A quick menu that's got every item you've ever picked up in the game. Is there a way to wait there? Is there a way to sort this? Sort. What what is that? What does that what does that even do? Like, sort by type, sort by attack power, most you ah, sort by most used, that's actually good, sort by type, I'd rather have it sort by power, but you can't do that on these, so that's pathetic, uh, right, Sort by ah, that, I suppose that'll do. Right, um, let's go and find this guy. <laughs> hey, you! Show Josh the picture you took of the statue. Hey! That's it. This does match what's on the fragment. This figure must be showing people of some sort, whoever they were. Which confirms my theory that people lived in the depths. I'm sure we'll find more traces of them if we keep searching. This is a big, big, big discovery. Now what's next? The possibility is there's so much more to research. Oh, but before I focus on that, there's something I want to give you as thanks for helping this stage of my investigation. Zonite. Hmm. I feel as if those contain some kind of strange power, like maybe it's energy or something. Anyway, they might help you in your search for Princess Zelda. <laughs> Yeah, we need. I, I don't know. I'm sure it cost three zonite to get one orb, and we need a hundred orbs to get one power upgrade, which is fucking ridiculous. So we need three hundred zonite before we decide to go back and trade it in. But then it's not as easy as that because it only gives you like ten at a time. What the hell? I want to sift through everything that our servers have brought back down here. Maybe there's even more fragments that I can piece together. Goggle Swordsman. Thank you much for going. Lads, I'm going to Google how long this game is. I think this game is going to be like ridiculously long. I don't think it's going to be very fun. From what I've seen anyway. Um, Right. Is this a weapon shop? Ooh. Oh. You interested in a sword? 
There we have a soldier's broadsword, a knight's broadsword, and a royal broadsword. They're a bit worn. We've got some life left in them. Feel free to take them. Each sword handles differently. Yeah, okay. Okay. We just want the one that does the most damage. Oh. Huh? You just said feel free to take... Light nimble. It can unleash charge attacks quickly. I was going to give it to you, but you look like you don't have room for any more weapons. Oh. Jesus Christ. Do I care? Is there a reason why I can't just pick it up? I don't care. That I don't care. The menu, I, I hate the menu. I just... The game is frustrating. Bro, let's just pick the fucking sword up. Right, where are we going? I just want to do the main quest. I need to go and see Pura. I need to find out where Rito Village is. What other village? Ah. Yeah, whatever. Hmm. Jesus Christ! I just want to. I just want a, a dialogue hmm. option that lets me tell me where I'm hey. supposed to go. Pure pad. Also, ah. oh, now she's going to tell us about that. Right. Where is Hebra? Up in the northwest. Right, we're headed northwest. Right, we're headed northwest. I've got Check. cold gear. Excellent. Right, we're going northwest. Let's go, baby. We need to heal. Ah, we need to cook first. Because we're going to go on a massive journey here. What the fuck? The fuck said it? I, what, what, I just get struck down by lightning randomly. Bro, I'm in a town. I have to speak to this bitch again. I don't have to speak to her again because I know it's in the northwest. Right, okay. Oh. Where's the pot? Where's the fucking pot gone? Oh, here it is. Right. Good to have simmered fruit because, like, it's nice to have the ability to just heal like two, two health bars. Oh, you don't cook them. It's bad, isn't it? Oh no, spicy peppers. Oh no, no, no. We can craft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These give you these. Well, that's actually we need them because we're going to a cold region. Can we like add something else to this? Raw bird dump. I'm I'm adding this. Spicy drumsticks, lads. We're just brewing some KFC. Bad boy, spicy pepper steak. That is godlike. Oh. 
cook me some KFC chicken wings. A golden apple. I'm not going to use that. Right, that's enough of that. Wait there. Save it here before we get electrocuted to death. Right, we're going to head northwest. See if we can actually make some progress because I feel like we're just floundering about doing menial, repetitive tasks. Oh no, I'm going to die again. How do you like? We need to sleep. We need to sleep. Eh, uh, morn. Morn will do. Right, so priority. We're gonna head northwest. We're gonna keep an eye out for horses. Northwest. I don't need that pin. Yeah, we're going to keep an eye out for horses. And hopefully we can actually get a mount. this oh rupees ah so that's what they are Green Belt Cave. You mug. Traveler's Claymore Broadsword is damaged badly.
Seven, that's not very good at all, is it? What is this? Halberds be a six, it's terrible. Secret room over there. I'll get that in a second once I get up here. Spiky spear. Pretty dog shit as well. I kill that. Now that wasn't good. No, 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 no. Big boy over there. That's not breaking that, is it? Hearty truffle. This might actually work though. Beautiful. Oh, there's a rock. Hmm. I want to keep the traveler sword for something good. We don't have anything. We don't have any base weapons, which is a shame. Long stick. This is going to be terrible, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's the worst thing I've ever seen me like.
Wait, horses. Forced them a bit. Let's find out what these guys actually want. I've seen a few of these guys with signs. Oh. Oh. President Hudson, are you okay? Do we have to build like a support system for a science? What have I done? That was unforgivable. It's all your fault to start with me like that. Just a sign, but I gotta have respect for President Hudson. Unforgivable. He's the president of the construction company. She placed him in charge of putting those material caches everywhere, and now he's shouldering Hyrule, Hyrule's restoration. Of course, he's also the founder of Hudson Construction. Besides that, blah blah blah, right? Just tell me the fucking point, man. Put up these signs all over the place. I don't know what to do. Try letting go. Are you going to support him? Alright, let's go. Bro, I can sort it out. Just give me two seconds. There you go, mate. Fixed. Uh. Fixed. Damn, uh -huh. bitch. He's not gonna fall. He's magic. That was brilliant. I should never. Th I sh would have never thought of it. All right. Let's get him secured while he's still standing. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. Fills my heart with joy. Take this. 20 rupees. Okay, so that's how we get money. We've seen a couple of, I've seen a couple of these guys around the map. At least we now know what to do with them. I'd kind of ignore them because I was sick of talking to pedestrians. Special gift. Bomb flower. See you, mate. Still none the wiser on finding a horse. Oh, big boy. Really? Trees love fire. Oh, it's already on fire. I'll just leave it. Burn, son. Imagine we can chop it down if we had an axe, but we, oh, we don't have it. We need an axe weapon. That's what these flints are for. Oh, there's rocks. But right, never mind. Sturdy thick stick. Oh, 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 we're a fucking lizard. 
Monster Extra. Now, we could combine this, ex it's extra durable. Wait there. I want to save this here. So does that mean if I put that on one of those, those? Actually, we've got a, we've got an awesome sword here, don't we? What's this? Rusty hull. Rusty weapons are shit. There's a chest over there, right where there. Traveler's sword. If we combine the traveler's sword with, well, we could put a rock on the end of that, but that's not going to do much damage. That's extra durable for enemies. That's awesome. And a, a, a shit traveler sword, which is fine. So many places to explore. Oh look, there's another shrine. Which it will do. Let's call an episode here. I'll probably go down the well. Actually, what we'll do. First thing next episode, we'll do the shrine because it's there. Then we'll go down the well because I don't know where the well's gonna take us or where it's gonna spit us out. But at least if we get the shrine done first, it'll be done. And then we'll continue heading in the, the northwest direction. Probably through there. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's going to put us into a new region. Pretty much straight to where we need to go. Happy days. Let me save it there because we've changed the map. Done. Okay, lads. Hope you enjoyed the episode. See you in the next one.